In this quick segment, I wanted to talk about how to do left justification, right justification, and centering strings in Python. So let's do this quick and let's get started. So let's pretend we have a string of characters and we'll call it that. We'll just say aloha, right? And if you just printed the string by itself, what you're going to see is just the word. So if I hit print, there it is. But let's say you wanted to do some left or right justification. It's really easy in Python. All you're going to say is that let's make a, let's modify this. So we'll say string dot, we'll say left justify. And you want to be able to say, well, how much do I want to left justify by? We can even say, you know, 50 characters. So if I hit save, I hit run, it doesn't say anything, right? But if I do a comma, and I do an equal sign, I hit save, I hit run, there it is. Before, you couldn't see it because it's already left justified. But I've added more characters so you can see the justification because this is what I did, the equal symbol here. Now, you could also do this. I could say, beside left, we could do right. So let's right justify. And I run it. There it is, right justified. And there we have it. And we could also say uh, center. So instead of saying R just or L just, we could say center. We hit save. And there you go. And just for clarification, you don't need to do this. You don't need that. If you wanted to, you could, you could just do that and just drop that in there and hit run. And now it's centered with characters to the left and to the right that you can't see because spaces are things too. So when would you use this and why would this be important? Well, let's pretend you're building like a menu or an interactive uh, game or, or whatever it is and you need your text justified to the left, to the right, or centered. For example, let's say you're building a menu of items in a list and you want to give that menu a title and you want that title to be like right in the center, right in the center so all the data flows beneath it. You could use the L just, R just, or the center function to go ahead and do that. And it makes your code look a lot cleaner and it's easy to read. Just remember, users want something easy to read. Okay. That was a quick one. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel, that'd be awesome if you did. Until then, I'll see you later. Bye.